Deciding on your university firm and insurance choices is a big decision, and it can sometimes feel overwhelming. But don't worry, the student room is here to talk you through the process, so you can be confident and make the decision that's best for you. Firstly, what are firm and insurance choices? Your firm choice is your favourite university. This is the one you really want to go to. Usually, but not always, this will have higher grade requirements. Your insurance choice is your backup university. This is the university you would be happy to go to if you don't get into your firm choice. Usually, this is a safe option, where you'll know you'll likely make the required grades. On results day, if your firm choice confirms you, then you'll be going to that university. You can't choose between your firm and insurance on results day. This is a common myth. You'll be able to make your firm and insurance choices once you've received responses from every uni you applied to. The deadline is different for everyone, so make sure you check with UCAS about when you need to respond. There's no advantage in making your choices early, so take your time and make sure you're happy. Once you've made your firm and insurance choices, all your other options will be automatically rejected. Once you've made your decision, it is complicated to change, although not impossible, so make sure you're happy. You also don't have to have an insurance choice. If you don't choose one and you miss your firm offer, you'll just go straight into clearing. It's better to have no insurance choice than one which you don't really want to go to. It's important to make sure you understand your offer conditions, including subjects, grades, and anything else the university might be asking for. If you don't get accepted by your firm or insurance, you'll go into clearing on results day. Sometimes universities give out unconditional offers before results day. If you get an unconditional offer for your favorite university, that's brilliant. Check the conditions of the unconditional. Do you need to make them your firm or insurance first? You'll still need to sit the exams for the subjects you said you would. If you're thinking of firming a uni just because they offered you an unconditional in return, remember that this is a big decision, so take the time you need. Your firm university should be your favorite choice. If you make an unconditional firm, then you'll be going to that uni on results day, whatever grades you achieve. It is complicated to change this, so be certain. Make sure that both your firm and insurance are in line with the grades you're expecting to get, unless you're happy to take a gap year and try again next year, or are happy to go through clearing. Remember though that lots of people feel anxious about making their grades and do better than they think, so don't underestimate yourself. If you have any more questions about making your firm and insurance choices, then jump on the student room. Just follow the link in the description. Good luck with your uni application.